traveling has changed quite a bit since last year, especially international travel. Countries are constantly updating their restrictions and safety protocols. Good evening and thank you for joining us on this special edition of 4 News Now. I'm Emily Bloom. One Spokane Valley couple couldn't wait to get away on their first vacation in years. It started out as a dream, but quickly became a nightmare when they weren't allowed to leave. Esther Bauer shares this exclusive story and has advice if for you if you're planning a trip coming up. Many of us would love our vacations to last a little bit longer before we fly back home, but one local couple got more than they bargained for, ending up stuck in Costa Rica, just waiting to get back home. This was a nice little getaway of, of just doing nothing. Doing nothing but relaxing and enjoying the sunsets in Costa Rica. That's what Tammy and Patrick Curley were looking for. We haven't had a vacation since like 2018. But the vacation wasn't their only surprise. No, we're not sick, but because of the protocols, we're stuck. Stuck until further notice. Before flying back home, everyone has to take a COVID test. Both are fully vaccinated, but still tested positive and couldn't get retested, even though they say the test they were given has a high false positive rate. Both have no symptoms, but no choice. In the scheme of things, we're being fed and, uh, yeah. And they could be a lot worse. They passed the time playing games together, drawing on their iPads and journaling. But 26 days away from home has been hard. That's been the worst part of the, the whole part is I, I don't have access to all the medications that I have yeah. at home. But um, he's been doing really well taking care of me as much as I can. Doing what they can to stay positive in paradise with one message to anyone planning an overseas trip. I think if you're taking on medication, make sure you have at least two weeks extra so with you. If, especially for places like this, in case of quarantine, for whatever reason, be prepared. And if all goes according to plan after meeting with the doctor and the airlines, Tammy and Patrick should be flying back home tomorrow morning from a trip they definitely couldn't plan and one they won't forget. Reporting in Spokane, Esther Bauer, 4 News Now.